Now, guys, the first question is draw the free body diagram. Okay. Now let's start with the M2. So here on the M2, you you will have a weight. Okay, what is pulling down the block? So you know you have the. It's going to be M2 G, right? And also you've got um you've got a tension. So you've got. You can say this is G two because this is mass two. You've got G two here, right? Okay, so here when it, on this block, you've got okay. Let me read here. You've got a weight, right? You've got a weight which is M one G, right? So because this is an incline, you, you should have uh, the components, okay? So now for the components, it means that now you, you on this side, you, you, you will have a um, horizontal component going this direction. So the horizontal component, it will be Will it be M one so sorry I'm I'm struggling with the pen. It will be M one G because it's horizontal, it will be cos cos theta, right? Suppose this is equal theta, and then here the angle, this angle here is the same as this angle here. And then from here, you'll have a, here, you'll have a, a vertical component, which is M1 G sine sine And theta, right? So now, with all that being said, so it means now you are this force is no longer valid, right? Okay. So another thing that we we we, we should know is that here we, we will have a a normal force, right? Left and obvious, which is the same as this one, right? So this n will be M1, even though they're going to cancel. M1 G cos cos theta, right? Okay, so now, and also here, you will have um, this tension here on the on the cord. You will have a tension here. You can call this T T one, right? You can call it T one. So now you doesn't that what is the magnitude of the acceleration? So we have to find the acceleration. So to find the acceleration, we start here. Where we normally start, we say F, we use the second law, Newton. I write Fn to say is F net, which is equals to Mt, that's the total mass, multiplied by, by, that's the acceleration. So, another thing here, we have to know that this is the bigger mass. It means that now your whole system will shift, will go to that side of the bigger mass, right? This is 3.70. So now your direction of motion, it will be, so we can choose here, this is the acceleration. 
you can choose downward as positive right you can choose downward as positive okay so now your acceleration will be equal to f net which is fn all over by mt here all right so what is um f net so i said you you must ignore the the tension for now because we just regard this as a as a one system right if this one moves and this one will move so now um you will have um so let's start here so this is m2 so the forces acting on the m2 is weight you will have a weight which is m2 g okay minus so now if this one is going if this one is going up the weight will try to push it down and then if it's going up which means that this one is going down so they're in the negative direction so what are the forces acting here this and this will cancel out so now we have got this m1 g sine theta right i said we ignore the tensions for now so you'll have m1 g sine sine theta okay divided by you are mass total it will be m1 plus you are m2 right so now when we're here you can come and take out the common factor of g right so it will be m2 minus what minus m1 m1 sine Then theta multiplied by g all over by m1 plus m2. Right? So now this your m2 here. You are told that your M2 is 2.30. So you will have 2.30. Okay. Minus your M1 is 3.70. It's 3.7. Zero multiplied by your sine theta. Your theta is thirty in this case. Okay, multiplied by sine your sine theta, right? So everything multiplied by 9,8, right? And then you divide it by, by the sum of the masses, which is um, the mass one is 3.7, 3 0, 3 
3.70 plus your M2, which is 2.30. 2.37 and then you can just try to simplify here sin, sin theta is equals to 1 over 2 you know that so now you should get uh, about um, so when you put this on a calculator you'll get 0 0.3 0. 3 7 Okay, you'll get 0. 0.3 7 My calculator is giving me the wrong answer Okay You should get about um, 0. 0.735 Okay, meter per second squared. All right, so now we, we chose that direction. So I, I was concentrating here. It means that now it will be upward. I'll just write up. Ne? But it doesn't matter also because they just want a, only the magnitude here in this question, you know. Um, so that will be the acceleration. So for us to get a tension, for us to get a tension, you do the same. You can just consider also this block here and do the same principle, right? So you you will have. Um, F net. So consider now we we for the tension we consider this block only, right? So it will be F n, which is the F net, which is equals to M M a, right? So what M? Which M is M two, right? So now. You, you just have to determine the force is acting on the M2. So the force is acting on the M2 is M2G, that's your weight. You have your M2G, M2, G. So now the tension is upward, so it's in opposite direction. So you should, you should subtract it, right? So when you subtract it, you should have um, T2 here, which is equals to M2A. Okay, so now when you make this T2 subject to the formula, your T2 will be equal to, it's simple, you transfer it to the right-hand side, it will be positive, and then you take this one into the left-hand side, it will be negative. So you have a M2, G, minus M2, A, right, which is equals to so here you can take the common factor of M2. So you mean that you will you have G minus A. That's the acceleration. Multiply by M2 together. Okay. Now you will have um, G minus A. That's nine point eight nine point eight minus a 
is 0 0.7, um, 0 0.735, 0 0.7, 3, 5, right? Multiply by M2, which is 2.37. Point three zero, and then when you put this on a calculator, you can just put in a calculator everything here. You should get um, um, about um, twenty point eight five. 20.85. Okay, you can also prove this, you know, just prove you, you just choose maybe this block and then you subtract the, the tension and then this one, also this force, we subtract this force and this one, so you should get the acceleration of this field, you know. Okay, don't forget to subscribe and then and like and share. I think you will see you soon.